The journey of one Santa Fean. The musical artistry of Santa Fe's own Jerry Lopez will forever be linked to the Fiesta de Santa Fe. His grandmother, Magdalena Griego, wrote Que Viva la Fiesta, which is sung at the opening of the festivity and throughout the three-day event. Magdalena also wrote the song that is heard as people process with La Conquistadora, this nation's oldest Madonna, who, along with Don Diego de Vargas, are listed as the two central figures in the 1712 Fiesta Proclamation. Before Jerry and his brother Gilbert had reached school age, they were on their way as recording artists and performed on the Plaza Bandstand at Fiesta through their teens with performers like Genoveva Chavez and Alan Muniz. Through the early part of the 1970s, Los Hermanos Lopez were part of Santa Fe's nightclub circuit at La Fonda and El Nido with Vicente and Ruben Romero. In 1975, the family moved to Las Vegas, Nevada, and Jerry's dream of becoming a professional musician was realized. In addition to working as a musical director on the West Coast, his band, Santa Fe and the Fat City Horns, tours nationally. At the start of the millennium, Jerry was the lead guitarist and sideman to Ricky Martin's worldwide tour, Live in La Vida Loca, where he was featured on the Today Show and at Madison Square Garden. Never one to forget his roots, Jerry Lopez performs annually in Santa Fe during Hispanic Heritage Month to raise scholarships for the National Latino Behavioral Health Association. The autumn concert is held at the Lenzic Theater just up the street where his grandfather, Nicolás Escajeda, was a weaver and a soloist in the choir at the Cathedral of St. Francis of Assisi in the 1930s. This is Ana Pacheco with Threads of Santa Fe History.